for the analyzing process and the radiation we strike on electron of the atom and it will produce the electron which is free electron and valence electron. Six important things what you need to know about ionizing chamber. First, metallic surface chamber will act as a cathode. Second, a rod will act as an anode. Third, the power supply to supply the electrical potential. Measuring device as a number four to measure the voltage. Number five, insulating material. And the last, number six, radiation. First, gamma rays will first enter the chamber through filter at the surface of the cylindrical metallic chamber. Second, gamma rays will collide with gas particle in the chamber and then ionize. And then, ionized particle will go to their respective polarity. Electron will go toward rod or inlay at anode and positive ion will go toward chamber at cathode. The advantages of ionization chamber First, preferred for high dose rate because no dead time Second, good uniform response for gamma rays Third, accurate overall dose reading And the advantages of ionization chamber First, Operation and accuracy easily affected by moisture. Second, no charge amplifier as it needs high amount electrometer circuits. Third, require very thin filter for alpha and beta rays. 